welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my like clothing corner, we can call it. This is where I stand and this is where I turn my apartment into a little clothing boutique whenever it is time to do a haul. So we are back here and I'm so excited to be doing another haul with Princess Polly for the springtime. Now, you guys really liked my last haul that I did with them and the last haul that I did, this was two months ago, I stayed very like true to what I like. I really shopped like within my comfort zone, stocked up on a lot of basics for the springtime, which is amazing. I love Princess Polly for basics. What I'm wearing right now um, was from my last haul. We have these crossover jeans and this white tank top and I've just been living in these clothes since I got them. Then Princess Polly reached out and wanted to do another spring haul and so I said, you know what? This time I'm gonna shop outside of my comfort zone. I will be like a little guinea pig for you guys to try out some more like trendy spring pieces um, and see if I like them. We're gonna shop outside of my comfort zone and hopefully this encourages you guys to shop outside your comfort zone and otherwise you can just live through me and see what I'm trying on. So I actually have yet to try any of this stuff on. I really wanted to give you guys my first reaction on camera. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. So why do I always go back to Princess Polly? It's just, they're just the best online shopping experience. I used to be so skeptical about shopping online, but once you find a store that their clothes fit you well, you like the way that their clothes wear and wash and last, I find you just stick to it, right? Like stick with what you know, stick with what's good. And for me, that's always been Princess Polly. After a few times of shopping there, I've really learned how to navigate the site, what my sizing is like, and it's just perfect. The best part in my opinion about Princess Polly, aside from the clothes, is that they offer a really good international experience. They're a boutique originally from Australia, but now they ship worldwide. And for me as a Canadian, it's always been a struggle to find cute clothes from online stores that ship here, that don't charge you like a ton of duties at the door. And what I love about Princess Polly is, first of all, you have free shipping over $70 Canadian, and you get to prepay the duties and taxes. So there's no surprises at the door. Like there's nothing worse than ordering all of your clothes and then they come, but you have to pay like a hundred dollars or something just to unlock them from the, like from the shipping. I was gonna say security service from the shipment carrier. So Princess Polly just gives a really good experience for international customers. And I love that you can shop in your own currency. It's simply great. And as usual, I have a discount code for you all. You can use code Zoe20 to get 20% off your order, which is amazing. So let's get into the haul. You guys can see if there's something you like and let me know in the comments what your favorite piece was. All right, so I divided the rack between bottoms. We have like one top um, and actually two tops. We'll go like this, um, three sets and two bathing suits. So I really went outside of my comfort zone for most of this. I also got two pairs of shoes. I've never purchased shoes from Princess Polly. So along with going out of the comfort zone, I was like, let me try the shoes because they always look so cute, but it's again, tricky. It can be shopping for shoes online. So I got two pairs of shoes and I got a bag. So where should we start? Okay, we're gonna, let's start off like nice and easy. I got two pairs of white pants. Now, for the spring, white pants are like everything. Spring and summer, these are great because when it's a bit cooler, like where I live in Montreal, the weather fluctuates so much. So some days it's really hot, some days it's really cool. And when you wanna still have that like springy vibe, but you wanna be a little bit warmer or you wanna be a little bit more covered up if you're going to the office, if you're gonna be spending a lot of time inside, whatever it may be, white pants are like the best for that. So I first just got this pair of white jeans. I don't really own any like white jean jeans, so I thought I would try these. Let's go try them on and I will give you guys my first reaction. Okay, I am obsessed, I'm so happy. When I first put them on, they felt a little big, but then as I was standing in the mirror, I realized that it's actually a good thing that I sized up. So I got these in a size US six. Whenever I'm unsure, I tend to size up. Um, I would say I usually wear around a 26 or 27, sometimes 28, like, my body fluctuates so much and it also fluctuates between stores, but Princess Polly has a really good like fit finder on the website and I also read the reviews of the product. Um, every single product I check the reviews to see like sizing recommendations. So 
I would say like my true size would be a four. So I sized up to a six in these and I'm really glad I did. Um, they are a bit loose. Like if I were to wear them up here on my waist, they're a bit loose. We see have like a lot of room in the back. What's nice is that these are a bit looser so you can comfortably go more low rise without feeling like it's cutting into you. Um, my stomach is always a bit more of an area of insecurity for me. So like I would totally go out like this. I feel comfortable, I feel confident. And these pants just look great. They are like a straight leg. They have a raw hem so at the bottom it's like unfinished which I think looks really good. And I love how it looks with the white top. Like I will definitely, definitely be wearing this and I feel like with white sandals, like white Birkenstocks, this would just be such a cute outfit. So I'm really, really happy, love these pants. The other thing I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video is as I like to do with all of my hauls, I just ate right beforehand. So you guys are getting my like belly full impression because there's nothing worse than when you try on a pair of pants or a top or a bodysuit, whatever it may be. And maybe you try them on first thing in the morning or when you haven't eaten in a little while and everything Thing fits perfectly but then as soon as you eat your stomach expands and your pants don't fit you anymore or they're uncomfortable so you guys are getting my like belly full impression which I think is important when you're shopping for clothes so let's talk about these next white pants that I got these are definitely out of my comfort zone these are like a cargo pant style which I don't think I've ever owned like even when I was a little kid I think I was like no to cargo pants um, so they have like a pocket on the side they've got pockets on the back let's go try them on okay <laughs> These pants are definitely outside of my comfort zone. When I first put them on, I, and I looked at myself front on in the mirror. I was like, whoa, um, because they're very wide. I'm not used to having pants this wide. But the cool thing is that they're really comfortable. They're a mid-rise again, so I feel like I'm participating in the low-rise trend. Um, or the low rise comeback. Maybe it's not even a trend. Maybe it's like a comeback. Um, but I do think I should have gotten a four. So I think you can stick with your original size for these um, because I do have like a lot of room, which is good because it's comfortable. You could wear these out for dinner. You can wear these for like sitting for hours in a park, which is what I love to do in the summertime. Um, and it's cool. Like they have all these pockets. Definitely out of my comfort zone though. I feel like I would feel more confident wearing these out to like a bar at night because they're a bit more cool, more edgy. Um, for my morning walk with my dog, we'll see. Maybe I'll wear them for the first time out, see how I feel in them, get used to being out of my comfort zone. And then next thing you know, I'll be walking around Montreal in these. My dog is like passed out at my feet right now. Can I show you guys? She's just like passed out right there. <laughs> And before I moved away to film and put on these pants, she was on top of my foot. Like, you guys, we're so codependent on each other. It's crazy. Um, okay, next up, I got two pairs. So this is, okay, we're back to my comfort zone now. I got two pairs of sweatpants. Well, one is a sweat short, and the other are the sportive and relaxed sweatpants. These may look familiar to you guys because I showed them in my last haul, but I actually got these, I think, two years ago. They're my favorite sweatpants that I own. So I got a second pair as a kind of insurance policy or to have one pair that I can dress up and wear out of the house and the other pair to be like my at home ones because I just love this whole sportif and relaxed collection. And these are the nicest sweatpants I have ever owned just in terms of look, in terms of the color, I love the cream but also in terms of how they feel and how they fit. I love them so much. So these are just kind of a no brainer. If you guys are shopping on Princess Polly for the first time, you need this sweat set. It has a really cute sweater that goes with it. I will show you in the try on, um, but these are awesome. And they have this cute little detail on the back. I love it so much. And I got a size six to be extra comfy in these. All right, now these next shorts I love so much. I'm a huge fan of the sweat shorts, trend, movement, whatever you want to call it. Um, and these are the Florida sweat shorts. I got them in a size six. And I also have the matching sweater that goes with it. I bought it um, a couple years ago. I bought it off Princess Polly. I got it for myself for Christmas. And I didn't even know they had matching shorts with it, but when I saw these, I had to get it. So I'll show you guys in the cutaway what it looks like when I have both on. Um, but I'm excited, I haven't tried these on yet, so let's go try. 
I am in love. This is the sweater that I was talking about and the shorts are so perfect. I feel like this is a great Montreal spring option because you can leave the house with your hoodie on and then if it gets too hot, you just take it off. Um, it's also like a nice cozy vibe for, you know those days where it's really warm outside but then the wind blows and it's kind of cold? I feel like this is like a good safety outfit. Plus for someone like me who works from home and likes to be in comfies all day, it's so, so perfect. I like how the shorts are very high-waisted and they're also pretty long, so I feel like you have good coverage. They're so soft on the inside. I'm just like obsessed with this, like so obsessed. <laughs> all right, next up, let's step back outside of the comfort zone. Um, I have two little bralettes. The first is this white one and the second is this brown one. Now these I really like because they're fun to pair with things like the white pants that I just showed you guys or with sweatpants. Um, I feel like you can dress these up, dress these down, even just wear them as a bra under something else. I think it's perfect. Another look that I'm really obsessed with lately is like jean shorts or leggings with a crop top and a blazer. I feel like looks really, really good. So I'm excited to try these out. Let's start with the white one. Okay, we are cutting right away to the brown one because the white one just did not fit. It looked so cute on the model on the website, but I'm a 34D and I just need more support than that was offering. I feel like if you have smaller breasts that don't require a little bit of lift, um, then that would be great for you. But for me, it just didn't work. I ordered it in a size eight and it was too loose in the band, but then not big enough in like the part that actually covers like your boob and your nipple. Um, so yeah, unfortunately that didn't work, <laughs> but this one works and I'm really happy. It's so cute. This is called, I think this is called the Camilla bra. Yeah, it's called, <laughs> this is called the Camilla bralette, which is the name of my best friend. Um, and it's in this really nice brown color. I love brown. I feel like it's really flattering on me. I feel like it's really flattering on most people, like a chocolate brown color. So this is great. And this one just has a little bit more support. It has like an underwire and it has a clasp in the back. I think wearing this with like a blazer over top would be so cute. Like not sure I would just walk around like this cause I'm very exposed maybe for like tanning or just hanging out in the park. But I really, really love this. I feel like there's gonna be so many ways to wear it. And with a tan, it, well, even without a tan, it makes you look more tan. So this is really great. Okay, we're gonna move on to sets now. And I've never actually purchased a set on Princess Polly. They have so many options, but I was never sure with sizing and how would they fit. Um, but I do think when you shop as a set, you actually get a lot more bang for your buck. Um, it just can be a little bit tricky with the sizing. So I tried to go for things that weren't too tight. So for example, if this bralette came as part of a set with a pair of pants, I'm basically a large on top and a small on the bottom. So when you're shopping in a set and you can only buy one size, that doesn't work for me. Um, so I got some looser things that I feel like if I was just to get like a small or a medium, um, they would fit. So I'm excited to try these on and see how they go. Let's start with these two because I actually got two of the same. Now, a vibe that I'm really, really loving is like loose, linen looking, cottony. It reminds me of Florida. It reminds me of just being on vacation. It feels very serene and it's also really comfortable when you're working from home, sitting at your computer all day like I am, but then you can like throw a pair of sandals on and head to the park or head to like a brewery or wherever it is you like to spend your spring or summer afternoons. Um, so I got this set twice. I'm so excited. It's called the Chloe set. Got them both in a six. Should we start with black or white? We'll start with black. We've had a lot of white so far. So let's try the black one on. Remember when I just said my dog was codependent? So as I was taking those pictures, <laughs> I didn't realize that she had snuck up behind me and lay down on the floor and I turned around to walk back here and tripped over my dog. Great. <laughs> Here's the black set. Now it doesn't look the best with the brown, but I am obsessed. It's perfect. Like I feel like I've been seeing sets like these all over Instagram in like various colors and I really like the black option for maybe like a cooler day or just when you don't want to wear white. <laughs> um, this is really great. Now I do recommend sizing up. 
I got a size six and I find the shorts are a little bit tight. Um, I do think they will stretch out a little bit, but the way that those jeans were like very loose on me as a size six, these are not. So I would definitely recommend sizing up a size, um, but these look good. And I feel like in the videos, it's kind of hard to tell because it's black, so you can't really see the texture, but honestly, this is just a great little set for when you want something that looks good together, but you wanna be very effortless. Um, so let's give it a shot in white and see how it looks. I am obsessed. In white, this set is just like chef's kiss. Again, size up, they feel like they fit pretty much exactly the same, they're the same set. Um, but I really prefer the white. The black is cute, but this I'm in love with. Um, I feel like it just looks so effortless, beachy, so cute. I am going to Florida next week. Oh my God, next week I'm going to Florida. And this is gonna be perfect for wearing to the beach or to the pool, just throwing over a bathing suit. I am obsessed. In terms of transparency, I feel like the top is a little bit transparent, but the bottoms are pretty good. They're lined, which is amazing. Like when you have white shorts that are of this linen material, you wanna make sure they're lined because otherwise everyone will see your underwear. I'm wearing blue underwear and you can't see them with this. So it's just so perfect. I am in love. Now we have two more sets to try on. These next two are definitely a little bit more out of my comfort zone. We're gonna start with the green one, which is a little top and shorts. Meanwhile, are you having fun there? Look at it. You like it there? I don't mind. I don't mind. Green set is incredible. I love it so much. Um, the winning piece is definitely the top. It has like this cool, crisscross and tie design in the back. I do feel really supported in it, so it's perfect because you can adjust in the back and the straps are super secure. I feel like my chest is well supported and it matches so cute with these shorts. Like, wow, I just love it. This is giving like picnic in the park vibes. It's so cute. I got a size six and I feel like it fits very well. So again, I'd recommend sizing up. Um, or getting your true size. I guess with Princess Polly, it's just kind of turning out that my true size is a six, um, which is like a size up from other stores. It's so confusing. I can't be the only one who is a different size at every single store. Like, it's so confusing. Anyways, this set is a big win. This one is probably the most out of my comfort zone. I'm really nervous to see if I like it. Let's go see. I am so pleasantly surprised with this one. This is the kind of thing that even if I saw it on the rack, I would never pick for myself, but I really told myself for this video, like push yourself, Zoe, go out of your comfort zone. And I'm really glad I did. My favorite part of this outfit is the top. I just love it so much. Weirdly, I feel very secure in it. And it's the perfect amount of like revealing, but also covered up because here, like it's really covering all of my boob um, and from the back it just is so gorgeous I feel like it's very elegant now the pants are great they feel very comfortable I got them in a size 6 they're a little bit long so I would either have to wear them with heels or go get them hemmed the only problem with the pants is that they are see-through they're not lined um, so you can see in the try-on you can see my blue underwear so you would either need to wear no underwear with these or wear underwear that matches your skin tone um, so that you're not having like bright blue underwear sticking out like me but I really really like this set I can't quite think of where I would wear this I mean in Montreal in the summertime people dress pretty like out there like you could probably wear this out to a club at night or you could even wear this out for brunch I feel like people people really wear all kinds of things anywhere in the summer in Montreal which is great um, but I don't know I feel like you could also just wear this to the beach it's really nice I'm like very surprised by how much I like it okay so to wrap up this haul we have two bathing suits that I'm very nervous to try on. I don't know if I've ever even really showed myself in a bathing suit on camera. Um, so there's that. Talk about stepping out of my comfort zone. And we also have the shoes and the bags. So let's just get the bathing suits out of the way since I already talked about it. Um, these two are so cute. And I only, like I have such a hard time 
shopping for bathing suits which is why i really wanted to try princess polly swim what's good is that you can shop separately so you buy the top and the bottom separate so you can really get your true size in each um and we're gonna give it a shot i'm sorry you guys i can't stand here in a bathing suit i am not there yet with my body confidence. Um, but I will tell you about how I like them and I will show you some quick cutaways on the screen. They're just both very revealing, which at the pool or at the beach, I don't mind wearing. They're just something, I'm just really not there yet to show myself like that on camera. Um, but you guys, you're gonna get a quick little thing. I just can't stand here and spend too much time. Okay, um, so we'll start with the pink one. I love the pattern of this. It's so cute. The colors are gonna make you look really, really tan. This is definitely a skimpier vibe, more revealing, definitely great for tanning. Um, the bottom is super, super scandalous, um, which I like. I love, it feels very comfortable. Like I would actually feel confident at the beach wearing that. Um, but it's definitely the most revealing bathing suit bottom I've ever had. The top is nice. I like that it's a tube top. I think I would need someone to like secure me in better. But overall, I really, really like this bathing suit. I got a six in the bottoms, just perfect size, and an eight on top. This bathing suit I am obsessed with. The top covers perfectly. I got it in a size eight. It's just your classic triangle top. It just feels great. The quality, the, like everything. The bottoms are this cool like ruched effect and I read the reviews and they suggested that you size down. I kind of wish I hadn't because although they fit and are comfortable, it would have been nice to maybe have a little bit more coverage um, just like when you compare it to these. But overall I feel like they fit great and I'll bring both of these to Florida with me next week which is so exciting. So let's end off this video talking about the accessories that I got. We'll start first with this bag. Princess Polly has really, really good designer bag dupes. So if you're looking for like a little shoulder bag or a tote bag like this one, check out Princess Polly for like the same kind of designer shapes, but obviously without the designer price tag. I chose to get this white tote bag because I carry my computer around with me a lot or like water bottle in the summer. And this was just so big and looked great for like bringing to a picnic. If I'm going to spend the night at a friend's house or at my boyfriend's house, like you can just throw everything in here. Or if you're going to work from a cafe, it would fit your laptop and anything else that you need. And I like this cream color because I feel like I can do sort of an all white look like I have on right now with this bag and it would be perfect. And inside it's just one giant pocket, which is what I like because I just throw everything into my purses. I'm not super organized. Now let's do shoes. The first are these pair of cowboy boots. Very out of my comfort zone because they've got a little heel and some Western detailing. These are so freaking cute. I got them in a size eight and they actually fit perfectly. They're a synthetic or a vegan material um, and they go up pretty high on your leg, which I really like. These will be so, so, so cute for just like going for brunch, going for a walk, going to grab coffee. Like I see myself wearing these like crazy and I just love how high up they are. You can wear them with a little skirt and you just like feel out your Western cowgirl dreams. The last thing I got were these running shoes. Now these are definitely outside of my comfort zone and I'm really glad I tried them and got them. My white sneakers that are my like go-to, go everywhere sneakers have gotten so beat up so I wanted to try a new pair and these are so cool. These are like a platform, I think you, what are these, Air Jordan or Air Max, Nike? Definitely a dupe for the Nike shoes, but they have this cool platform, so they're like a little bit more elevated. I feel like with little ankle socks, these would look so, so cute. They have like the little Toro on the back and here as well, and they just lace up. I love wearing platform shoes because they just give you that extra boost of confidence and that extra like elevated feeling that wherever you go, you feel like you're stomping around and it feels really good. I also got these in a size eight and they fit perfectly. Um, so with the shoes, I would say I sized up a little bit because I'm usually a seven or a 7.5. And to be safe, I got an eight and they're both the right size for me. You guys would never guess, but trying on haul, sorry, you guys would never guess, but doing hauls and doing try on hauls is actually the hardest videos to film and edit because they're very physical. That is a wrap, you guys, on this haul. This was so much fun. It was so amazing 
shopping outside of my comfort zone, trying new things. I can't wait for you guys to see these outfits in my vlogs and on my Instagram. So make sure you're subscribed and following me on Insta so that you can see everything and stay in touch. Thank you so much to Princess Polly for working with me on this video. It's an absolute dream come true and I owe it to every single one of you watching this video. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you. I'm so grateful. I cannot thank you enough. And if you want to check out any of these pieces or anything else from Princess Polly, remember to use my code ZOE20 to save 20% off of your order. All right, you guys, that's a wrap. I'm in my feels now just thinking about how grateful I am. So thank you so much. I love you so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.